The sun is a burning ball of fire that never actually burns. Sounds like a paradox, right? Unlike a campfire or a candle flame, the sun doesn't burn fuel with oxygen. It produces energy through a process called nuclear fusion, deep in its core. Inside the sun's core, temperatures soar to about 15 million degrees Celsius, and pressures are unimaginably high. Here, hydrogen atoms smash together so violently that they fuse into helium, releasing an enormous amount of energy in the form of light and heat. This is the same process that powers hydrogen bombs, but controlled and sustained for billions of years. What's really mind-blowing is how long it takes for this energy to reach us. The light and heat generated in the core don't shoot straight out. Instead, they bounce around inside the sun for thousands to even a million years, zigzagging through dense layers before finally escaping into space. And the sun's fuel. It's been fusing hydrogen for about 4.6 billion years and still has enough to keep. Going for another 5 billion. Eventually, it will swell into a red giant and change dramatically, but for now, it's a steady, glowing nuclear furnace that powers life on Earth. So, the next time you feel the sun's warmth, remember, it's not fire you're feeling, but the energy of atomic collisions happening millions of miles away, lighting up our world in a cosmic dance of fusion.